are turned in here tonight. That is what they will be. EA Sports. It's in the game. All right, coming up next, a UFC featherweight division fight. Here he is, the decorated kickboxer, back for more here tonight. And he's so comfortable in the striking realm. It's almost like he started kickboxing before he ever was reading or writing. Oh, it's unbelievable to see someone that's so comfortable under so much duress. I know. When you're in kickboxing range, you are in the fire. There is no safety. You're right in range to be getting knocked out. But he does not fear that. He loves it. He loves the, com he loves the combat. He loves the engagement. What you have to understand is he's not engaging his opponents on their turn. He's doing it on his turn. Whether or not he wants to be in close with the big punches or he wants to be at range landing kicks, he's just constantly putting damage on you. Top, bottom, up, low, it does not matter. This guy is a dominant striker, one of the best kickboxers the UFC has ever seen. And in terms of the punching technique and the jab, as good as anyone in this division. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, Featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 141 pounds, fighting out of Nagoya, Japan, Chico. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. You can give me your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. seen in the UFC. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Try to establish that jab. Beautiful kick. There. That knee hurt him. Use that 
big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Big and kick. Head kick attempt, unable to find the target. Oh, nice knee. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Good kicks there. Lance with the right hand. Able to check that kick as well. Oh, it's a beautiful kick right there. I don't know if you've ever been kicked by a mule. Probably feels something like that. It has to. This guy has landed his kick with so much force. Just misses there with the left. Big punch lands. He lands the head kick. Oh! Oh, he lands a massive kick here. Oh, straight right. Can't take many of those. You better check. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Big head kick. Oh, big head kick there. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Check the high kick. Oh! Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. Oh, beautiful hook! Oh, collar tie. Nice. Oh, man, head kick lands. Oh, that's a good right hand. <laughs> Trying to go to the body here, unable to find the target. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, combination of knees. That is not what he is looking for. He better raise that guard quickly. He better raise that guard or he's going to fall asleep. You cannot allow someone to knee you in the head. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. Oh, big head kick. And they separate. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Round two straight ahead. All right, so the round is over, but not before damage was done. Cut on the cheek, sustained in that round. Cut man in there quickly as usual to try to seal it up. All right, so a huge round for him there. His opponent will need Motrin tomorrow. Huh. A lot of head kicks in that previous five minutes. He took way too many head kicks. He was trying to go forward. He was trying to pressure. And when he was doing that, he was carrying his hands low. And his opponent was just wrapping that kick up and over the side of his guard. Credit to his opponent for finding this shot, but really bad on him for not really making the adjustment to stop him. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. Oh, oh, what a job to get the head kick home, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Another shot to the body, beautifully placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Big head kick!
Good punch lands. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Beautiful body kick. Oh, I love the jab. I know you love the jab. That was a nice one. It's my favorite punch in all the fight. Oh, hey. oh, he the fight the score. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. caught with that punch. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Wow. Oh, lands a vicious uppercut to the head. Beautiful uppercut. Shades of Mike Tyson on punch out back in the day. You couldn't take one of those uppercuts or you would go down. Mike Tyson. Oh. Strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. Three minutes to go. An uppercut landed. Nice defense there. Huge block. Great punch. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one, and now starting to find himself in the pocket. Nice kick. It's not over. It's not over. Keep Trying to establish that jab once again. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. And maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got a very bad head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, he got everything behind that kick. Lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice land. Both fighters throwing heat now. Lee gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Ooh, what a punch. on the mat. All right, feet on the hips here. Well, hard to win fights in mixed martial arts from the bottom, but nice work here in that position by Lee. All right, dominant position for him here, full mount. If you're the bottom fighter, better start moving those hips, DC. Oh, you gotta start moving those hips. What you should do initially, right, is start to push at the knees. Push at the hips, create some distance, shrimp, and try to recollect half guard. Half guard sucks, but it's much better than being mounted fully by your opponent. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. Flip of the 
the right hand. And he continues to work the body here. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Just missed with the left there. getting lit up right now, John. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Just unable to quite find that range. Oh, huge head kick. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it. He's coming high. And now he's got him hurt bad. Oh! He's trouble. He's hurt bad. Now look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. Back to the feet. Oh, got him. He got him. A single collar tie there. And now he engages in a Muay Thai clinch, and I think a lot of people watching wonder how you can control an opponent like that. Hard to get out of. It's very difficult to get out of. Look and notice. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over! Unbelievable! Oh, my goodness, what a fight. Yeah, there's another one for the highlight reel, and that's probably as good a knockout as he's had in the UFC. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Crowd absolutely loving it. Flush land to close out his opponent. I'm not even sure the other fighters saw it coming. So a big knockout for him here tonight on the biggest of stages. And there he is after the huge knockout turned in tonight. Near perfect execution and one of the bigger highlights of his UFC career. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at 1 minute 55 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Chico! So the celebration is on with him and his team, and rightfully so. A monumental result tonight as he gets the win by knockout. He spoke it into existence. He said over and over to anyone that'll listen, I am going to knock this man out. He did it in an even more impressive fashion than he's ever